All right, so if you know anything about CPUs, then you've probably heard of something called a transistor. And you might not know what it is, so that's what I'm going to talk about today. It's the basics of what they are and how they relate to computers. Basically, you can think of a transistor as almost like a gate or an amplifier. You put in one signal that tells the transistor whether to allow another current to go through or not to go through. And usually the signal to activate the gate is a lot less than the signal to allowing through. So you can use a small signal to let through a big signal. So it can be used as an amplifier or it can also be used as an on-off switch type deal which you probably know about if you know anything about binary, a one or a zero on or off. Where if the signal allows the current through, it's on. If it doesn't, it's off. So it can actually have, each transistor can have a value of one or zero. So let's say a computer has a billion transistors in the CPU. Well, then that means that it has a billion switches that can go on or off. And that means that the clock frequency, which might be three gigahertz, is how many times that it can activate all those switches. So obviously the power of a CPU has to do with the number of transistors and the clock frequency. Obviously there's a lot more that goes into it. That's a very general statement, but at least you can get the basic idea. So as computers get more powerful, they're cramming more and more transistors into the CPUs and they get more powerful. And that's the basics of it. I hope you understood uh, I know a lot of you probably had an idea of the on or off switches, but didn't really know where they came from, anything like that. So hopefully this video was helpful. I hope you enjoyed it. Be sure to leave a comment what you think, like the video. Also follow me on Twitter. I like to interact with people on there and I also put out random stuff on there. It might be pretty interesting. And also like me on Facebook. All the links are in the description, that kind of stuff. And thanks for watching.